Every time we get sent a topic when they know that Craig Burley's on these hits, Arsenal's always one of them. Now, we may get into Arsene Wenger shortly, but this is about Thierry Henry and a quote that Thierry Henry has given. Have a look at this quote. Now, in essence, to paraphrase, it says that Arsenal are no longer an attractive destination for top players. Do you agree with what Thierry Henry is saying here? No, I do. And uh, he said many things that I've scratched my head about. But, but he's got a point. I mean, as good a club as Arsenal are, and, and they're a fantastically well-run club. I mean, I used to love going playing at Highbury because they're cl it's class. You had mm. the, 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 the guys dressed up at the front door, the marble inside, the way they treated you. And that was the away team. So they treated their own players and their own staff very well. They've built a good ship, built a nice stadium, and they run the club particularly well, to my understanding. Then you've got the football side of things that is heading south and has been for quite a while now. Now, if you were Ant if you let's look at some of the top players in Europe. If you're Antoine Griezmann, and he's one of the most coveted players, why would Arsenal be in your radar at the moment? Because unless the manager changes and you can convince somebody you're bringing five or six quality players in, why would you go there at the moment? It was like last year or whenever it was, I can't remember the time frame, they were talking about Higuain when he was leaving Napoli. Might be going to Arsenal, they need a striker. I'm not saying Arsenal are going to pay that money from the 90 million or whatever it was, but he, he said, no, I'm going to go to Juventus because I'll be winning the Scudetta. Oh, I'll be in the Champions League and we'll be competitive and I know I'm going to have good players and working for a quality coach. So that's where the top players are gravitating to these clubs. The bottom line is the top players want to play in the Champions League. I wonder if this is a quote that Thierry Henry would have made if Arsenal were in one of the Champions League spots or having a better chance for that. The other thing is as well, if Wenger wasn't there and they were doing better, does he make the same I, I don't think if Arsenal were sitting third at the moment that this, this changes anything because it would be the same as it's been for the last umpteen years. So they want to play Champions League, but they want to win. I think you've got to convince well. players, you know, if it's not just about the money for players, and for, everyone's different, if it's a bit, a, a bit of both, you have to convince them that we're not just going to be the, the afterthought in the top four every year and knocked out at the group stages uh, or, or in the first round of the knockouts as they were again, mm -hmm. hammered by Bayern Munich. But you've got to convince them that there's a Premier League title down the line, there's a Champions League semi-final stroke final down the line where you're going to be competitive. You've got to convince players that, that uh, the top players that this is happening. And I, and I for sure at the moment 100% believe that Arsenal can't. Wenger can't. And unless a new manager comes in with and bolstered by a big bucket of cash, you're not going to convince the Griezmanns and the players of that out to come to Arsenal at the moment. Karim Benzema has been talked about over the years. Why is he going to leave Real Madrid to go to Arsenal? It's not happening. Basically, if Wenger doesn't go, then the top players aren't coming, as far as you're concerned. Well, it's looking like the top, so-called top players, Ozil and Sanchez, are leaving, like Fabregas, like Van Persie, like the rest. And that, that's the way they're going until, until the top man decides, Mr Wenger, it's time and uh, enough's enough. Maybe even Arsene Wenger might realise when some of the stars of the past, like Thierry Henry, come out with comments like that. Come on, Arsene, maybe it's time to bid au revoir.